Welcome again to Ancient Tales for Today. Yes, a very old book with very old stories. Now, if you've been following along with this, we talked about a young man who was really in a hole. Now, that's a term we use nowadays to meaning that you're in a predicament or 情况非常非常不好. Okay, so he was in a hole, but he was literally Now, he is pulled out, he is sold. Now what happens to him? He is in Egypt. Stay by for another interesting story from a very old book with very good lessons for today. Number 31. False Imprisonment Joseph had been sold into slavery by his jealous brothers. When he arrived in Egypt, Joseph was sold to Potiphar, captain of the king's palace guard. Because he was very successful, his master put him in charge of his house and everything he owned. Joseph became his most trusted servant. It looked like life was getting a little better for Joseph. But then, huh, disaster. Because he was good looking, Potiphar's wife wanted Joseph to sleep with her. He refused her, saying he could not sin against his trusting mas master and his God. She kept on asking him day after day. Then one day he went into the house and she was alone there. She grabbed him by his robe and demanded that he go to bed with her. Joseph refused and ran away, but he left his robe in her hand. Then Potiphar's wife started screaming that Joseph had tried to rape her and had left his robe in her hand when she screamed. When Potiphar came home, his wife told him the same story. Potiphar was very angry and had Joseph thrown into the king's prison. I'm sure Joseph tried to explain that the story was not true, but Potiphar's wife did have his robe in her hand. Mm, that made it very difficult for him. Who would Potiphar believe? His wife or a slave? Joseph's life goes from crisis to crisis. He must have thought of home very often and his loving father. He had been betrayed by his brothers. Now he had been betrayed by refusing his master's wife. Oh, how difficult it must have been for Joseph. The story is old, but the situation is just like today. Jealous brothers, sexual advances, false imprisonment. <laughs> Sounds like a modern movie. What do we learn? That people can be very cruel. That life is not fair. But that we can stay true to our principles and live the best we can. Joseph had been sold into slavery by his jealous brothers. So what was the problem with the brothers? Tidu, jealousy. And they sold their brother into slavery. Okay, poor in. When he arrived in Egypt, Joseph was sold to Potiphar, captain of the king's palace guard. Okay, now, when he arrived in Egypt, Joseph was sold to Potiphar, Potiphar. This is a very important person. Captain of the king's palace guard. Okay, now we have a number of words there that we need to sort of explain. First of all, captain, Shang Wei, Shang Wei, 
This is a level, uh, this is a description of his work. He is usually, we say, captain in the army. The Song Wei is captain, okay? Of the king's palace guard. Okay, king's palace, Wang Gong. Okay, Wang Gong, king's palace. And guard is, this is the group of military people that, um, how should we say, uh, they control the palace. They work in the palace. They protect the king, you know, things like that. Because he was very successful, his master put him in charge of his house and everything he owned. In way ta, who's this? We should have probably said, uh, because Joseph was very successful, his master, ta the Turin, okay, put him in charge. Jiao ta fuzi, to put in charge. If I'm in charge of something, then I am responsible for something to control it or, or to be involved with it. Usually it means to control, to kong zhi, kong zhi, to be in charge of something. Okay, of his house. So he is responsible for his house, ta de jia. Okay, so this is, the, this is a very important person, the captain of the palace guard. Okay, and so Joseph now is in charge of the house and everything he owned, ta suo han yo de, suo han yo de. That means everything that this captain owned Joseph was in charge of. Uh, maybe Kan Guan is a, a nice way of saying to be in charge of. Joseph became his most trusted servant. What? His, Potiphar's, most Trusted servant. Zui Xin Ren de. So, things, in fact, it says it looked like life was getting a little bit better for Joseph. That's true. Kan qi lai hao xiang. Ta de ren sheng kai shi. Uh, or it was just getting better. So things are looking good for Joseph. Going on. Yeah, going on. But then disaster. Okay, disaster. In this case, something bad suddenly happens. Something bad suddenly happens. You know, things are getting better, and then something bad happens. Disaster. Sometimes uh, uh, we say zai huo, zai huo. But it just means something bad happens. Because he was good looking, Han Ying Jun, are you good looking? Men are good looking and women are beautiful. Iga Mei Li, Iga Ying Jun, okay? Because Joseph was good looking, Potiphar's wife, Potiphar's Qi Zi, wanted Joseph to sleep with her. Okay, so this is now a very bad situation because Potiphar's wife is also a very 
powerful person. He refused her. He refused her, saying, he could not sin against his trusting master and his God. In this case, to sin against means okay, to sin against Ta and his God. He refused her saying he could not sin against his trusting master. Bunang uh, she kept on asking him, almost like a faucet with dripping water, ED, ED, dot, dot, dot. She just kept on asking him, day after day, come on, nobody will know, just do it. Nobody will know. Then one day, he went into the house, and she was alone there. She was alone. That means there was nobody else. She was eager in, no one else, going on. She grabbed him, okay, to draw ta by his robe. So she's grabbed his robe. Tada wai yi, tada wai pao. She grabbed the robe and demanded. Demanded is not. Uh, uh, it means demand that ta zhong ming ling. Of course, she was the boss's wife, so she was in effect the same as his boss, ta de lao ban, ta de zhu ren, uh, demanded ming ling that he go to bed with her. So, gen ta tong fang. Joseph refused. Joseph refused and ran away. But he left his robe in her hand. But still, Now, what is going to happen? You'll have to wait for the second part of today's exciting story. Okay, now we're looking at some light on our path and we're going to look at Proverbs 20, 22. Do not say, I'll pay you back for this wrong. Wait for the Lord and He will deliver you. 经文说, 你不要说, 我要以恶报恶, 要等候耶和华, now I'm sure that it was very hard for Joseph. 是的, he, he, he did not do anything wrong. Yes, 他没有做错过什么, right. And, and now he is in prison, he's in the jail, 他在监牢. So 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 now what do you do in a situation like that? This Bible text gives us the answer. What, what should the person do? Yes, uh, of course. And that's the, that's the problem. And that's the reason why we need God to help us. Mm. Then you can wait for God to solve the problem. 
because Joseph refused and ran away, uh, she grabbed his robe. So he's running away without his robe. She has the robe. Then Potiphar's wife started screaming, Jin Jiao, that Joseph had tried to Ta rape her. And he left his robe in her hand uh, when she screamed. She said, when I screamed, when I yelled, he left his robe and ran away. Now, the problem really gets worse. When Potiphar came home, his wife told him the same story. Okay? Potiphar was very angry. Of course, he was very angry. And Joseph was thrown into the king's prison. King's prison, Wang de Jian Yu. I'm sure Joseph tried to explain. Of course, you tried to explain uh, that the story wasn't true. It's invented. It's not true. But Potiphar's wife did have his robe in her hand. She had some evidence. I have his robe. See? I have his robe. This made it very difficult for him, or that made it very difficult for him. Joseph, it was Who would Potiphar believe? Who do you think Potiphar would believe? His wife? Or his Puran Nupua. Who are you gonna believe? Okay. So of course he's forced to believe his wife. Although I don't think, somehow I think that there was that Potiphar really didn't believe that. Joseph's life goes from crisis to crisis. Song Weiji, Dao Weiji, okay. Crisis uh, to crisis. <sighs> he must have thought about home. Uh, we say homesick. Maybe he thought about home very often. And he thought about his loving father. Okay, ta, uh, ai ta de baba, ke ai de baba. Okay, of course you think about that when you're in prison and things, oh, fortunately he wasn't killed right away because, well, many times you just uh, killed, okay. He had been betrayed by his brothers. Okay, now here's all the bad things. Betrayed. He had been betrayed by his brothers. Going on. Now he had been betrayed by refusing his master's wife. Now he had been betrayed by refusing his master's wife. How difficult this must have been for Joseph. How difficult. Okay. Joseph It must have been very difficult for Joseph. The story is old. 
这个故事是老老的故事 ，maybe nearly four thousand years old. Okay, nearly four thousand years old. But the situation, 这个情况 is just like today. 真的像这个现代完全一样。Jealous brothers, 有哥哥们、弟兄们呢，嫉妒。Sexual advances, 性骚扰，性骚扰。We have all of those things nowadays. 现代就是有这个。And then false imprisonment. Oh, I didn't explain that. False imprisonment is 言语。监狱，这个无故的就摆在这个监狱里面。It sounds like a modern movie. 听起来好像是现代的电影片一样。So what do we learn? Like I said a couple times ago, oh, maybe there are many lessons to learn. 到底我们要学到什么教训 ？People can be very cruel. People, ah,、uh, can be very, ah,、uh, cruel. 很残忍，很残忍 ，very cruel. And also, another one is life is not always fair. 人生不见得是很 ，how do you say 公平 ？Life is not fair， 不公平。But we can stay true to our principles, even in bad situations. 在坏的情况之下，我们还是可以忠心于。我们的原则 ，We can stay true to our principles and live the best we can. We can, 我们过的生活可以按照我们最好的或者朝着那个方向啊、uh, 生活。With that, I'll be back in a little bit to wrap things up. Okay, words you need to know. 哎，老师啊，这个故事的题目哈、啊、很长， uh -huh. 而且不容易不容易明白。<笑>后来后来我才知道，意思是冤狱。请您读一读英文的发音好不好 ？Okay, false imprisonment. Now, false means 假的，不对的。嗯、对 okay. And imprisonment is 放监牢。对，下监，下监牢。Okay,、mm. so so now, 冤 How do you say 冤狱？啊，冤狱被冤枉的一个一个结果，进到监狱里面去。Yeah, okay. So let's go on to the next one. That was a long one. Let's look for a little shorter one. Oops. 好。Good looking. 哇，很好看。Am I good looking? Yes. Sure. <laughs> 哎呀，搞错。<laughs> 对呀、啊，因为我你很年轻，我就认识你。<laughs> <laughs> 对对 ，Well, when I was good looking back there. Okay, what does good looking mean in Chinese? 呃、uh, ，很好看。我想这个说到男孩子的话，是说他很英俊。Yep, that's true. Okay, to grab, or in this case, grab. What does? 抓，他想去抓他。Yeah, to grab something, ah,、uh, to take a hold of it quickly. 嗯。Okay, the next one is crisis. 危机，危机。Mm. Everybody has some crises. You 加一个 es if it's、mm. 多数 Okay,、mm. crisis. Well, I think that's about all the time we have for words you need to know. Well, in today's story. We looked at Joseph being thrown into prison, 无故的啊、uh, 放在监牢 or we say 
Yuan Yu. Okay, uh, that's a new word to me, but uh, you understand that. And that just means that there was no good reason for him to be in the prison. False imprisonment. Well, now we have Joseph in prison. Now, how is he going to get out of prison? You'll want to join us next time as the dreamer explains some dreams. And all of this happens in jail. See you next time. That's all for today, and thanks for watching. If you like ancient tales for today, please visit atft.chinesehope.tv. You may also contact us by writing to ancienttalesfortoday at gmail.com. Again, that's ancienttalesfortoday at gmail.com. Tell your friends about ancient tales for today. See you next time.